Well, hello to all of you beautiful people. My name is Metroid Chunky. Welcome once again to my lair. Today we're going to be playing One More Night. It's apparently a tower defense game of some kind, but with a twist. You're in direct control of your own character, and of course you make towers. It's basically a survival game. You know that good crap, kind of like Call of Duty Zombies, if you've ever seen that. So, without any further delay, and without any further voice strained by this friggin' voice, it's time to begin, shall we? Let's see, which one of the which one of these three lovelies am I going to pick? Am I going to go with Winston? The weird looking guy? Izzy? The lovely woman with blue? Or Max? Max Payne! Let's go with him! Max Carnage! Okay. I've got no money, so I, I can't really build anything, now can I? All I gotta do is survive long enough to actually, to actually be able to buy stuff. Red brain. Red. I, obviously, I'm... Obviously, I don't know how the game works yet, but we'll learn together. Yeah, hopefully the first zombies won't be that fast. Hopefully the game will go easy on me at first. Until it goes... Okay, the game is already going hard on me. What the hell? They're spawning everywhere. They're spawning in random ass locations. That hardly seems fair. Damn it. Crap. Okay, then. Okay, at least my ammo appears to be infinite. Even though they appear to be spawning literally out of thin air. Seriously. Some of those actually spawned in front of my face. That's not fair. Come on. If you're going to spawn them, at least spawn them on the outward edges so that they don't sneak up on me. Come on. That's just a cheap shot. Okay, here we go. Okay, can I afford to get towers after I get this money? Insta-kill. Sweet. Oh, crap. Well, I wasted that, didn't I? How do I build a tower? Uh, how do I build a tower? Oh, okay. I just have to figure it out as I go. I don't know. Are there certain spots that you have to build a tower on? I would guess between the crosses, but I'm not entirely sure on that. Don't, don't quote me. Crap. How do I build a tower? How do I build defenses? I want to build my defenses. Whatever. I think I'll just kill some more zombies for a while. They don't appear to be that tough yet. Unless they spawn in front of my face again, that would be... That would just suck. Or I just didn't see them before. That's probably it. It's probably because of the fog. I just didn't see the guy. It's not that he necessarily they spawned on top of me. It's just that I didn't see him coming. Since, uh, it seems to be fine now. Even though, holy crap, there are a lot of them. Well, I guess in a zombie apocalypse, there would be a lot of zombies. That just seems to be standard procedure. Which doesn't really make any sense if you think about it. I mean, I understand the initial, the initial infection, but after, once it actually got spread out that humans are being turned into zombies, wouldn't they try to prevent more people from turning into zombies somehow? I mean, come on. Get the National Guard out of there as fast as possible. You know, to prevent it from spreading further. Encourage people to board up their doors or something. You know, take preventative steps. I mean, hell, if you think you're about to become a zombie, just go ahead and kill yourself because... And I'm not even kidding. I'm not I'm not being callous by saying, oh, go ahead and kill yourself. Just kill yourself. I'm saying, if you think you would become a zombie for real, if there was an actual zombie apocalypse, and I thought I was infected, and I thought I was about to turn into a zombie, I would probably just shoot myself in the head right then and there, because, I mean, hell, isn't that better than the alternative? I would think so, right? How do I build towers? I, I don't know. It, there's got to be some kind of some kind of reference guide, right? You would think so. Okay, I keep clicking on the bad buttons that keep stopping the recording. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Damn it. I got to be better about that. Come on. Crap. Okay, I gotta figure out how to make towers or something. I think I accidentally opened my inventory somehow. Ah, damn it, what was that button I hit? Oh, please don't tell me it's one of the recording buttons. That would suck. That would really suck. 
Okay, whatever. Come on. I guess I'll just focus on killing the zombies for now. Even though I have no idea how to build towers. This game should really come with some kind of reference. That would be ever so helpful. You know, possibly. Come on. Here we go. Huh, more ammo. Not that it matters, I have infinite ammo for this gun. There's gotta be some kind of store or something, right? Crap. I'm letting them get close to me, that's not good. I keep trying to go for stuff. Fire rate! Yes, please! I want that. Yes! Take that, bitch! All you can just go die. I'll just increase my firing rate and then kill all you dead. Health! Yes! I need that. I found my med kit. Fabulous. That's super fantastic. So, where the hell do I build a tower on? Oh, okay. There, there's the shop. Huh. Tower. Oh, okay. Did do they just build automatically, or do I have to pick where they where they're built? It's subtracted from my money, so okay, there they are. Oh, here we go. Now I now I can. Sweet, <laughs> nice. Okay, I got three turrets now that are automatically shooting zombies for me, and they have limited health. Crap. Well, you know, I, I shouldn't expect them to last forever. It's basically like Plants vs. Zombies. In that they can get in the zombies' way and the zombies can kill them. But at least that's good for me. It helps me survive. Wow, that buffer did not last long, did it? You'd think it would at least last 30 seconds or something. Crap. Well, at least the turrets are helping. Kinda. The turrets have plenty of health. It would appear so. Crap, I need a... I should probably grab their... Ah, come on! Did my own turret attack me? Is that why I lost health there? I swear, I didn't see any zombies near me. So what the hell happened? Okay, I just can't open the shop while the zombies are still coming. Oh, crap. I get the buff right as the, the, the round ends. That sucks. Okay. Mortar. Tiny barricade? Okay. Okie dokie, then. Oh, okay. They're all still alive, fortunately. Huh, mortars. That is kick-ass. Yes! Blow them up! Blow them up. Just kill them all. Okay. Apparently there's no wrong way to place these. Probably be a good idea to not try to do this while the zombie round's already started, though. Huh. I'm learning. I'm learning. This is a learning experience. Nice. Oh, I love how they're going straight for that, not me, and not me, even though they can reach me. You would think they'd only reach it if they, if I was between them, if it was between them and me, but apparently they just straight up hate it. Oh yeah, it's, it's kind of like how zombies on hard mode, they they not only get between the door and you, but they will actively target doors even if you're not behind it, just because they hate doors for some reason. It's kind of like the same here. Oh, come on. Please let me please let me be able to use this once. Okay, I think I think I hit the zombie there, but didn't do me much good, did it? Seems as though the insta kill never lasts long enough for it to actually be useful. Okay. I can refill them. That's good. Okay. Can I get any better weapons? Oh crap, I need a lot more money. I need some, I made me some money, honey. I should probably save up my money. You know, not blow it on useless crap. Like refilling these. 
Yeah, why do I need to waste my money on that? It's not like it's important. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah, brains, whatever, all that crap. Ugh, screw you. Okay, time to get time to get this show started. Hey, pay attention to me, you jackass. I'm right here. Come on. Folk, notice me. Pay attention to me. Don't just give all don't just give my guns all the all the credit, all the attention. I want some attention too. Damn it. Come uh, come on. Okay. The problem is I'm being chased, so I can't exactly collect the money very efficiently. And then the money just ends up disappearing before I can even grab it, which kind of sucks. Come on. There we go. Oh crap, that's there goes one of my turrets. That sucks. There goes another one of my turrets, and I'm losing health. Crap. Who wants to kill? Yes, it finally came in handy for something. Yes. Haha. <laughs> nice, that actually did something. Whoa. The insta kill actually lasted quite a while. Hot damn. And I can actually get something. The M16. Uh, I'll get the shotgun. The shotgun is very reliable, I would assume. Crap, now I don't have any money to get any towers or anything like that. I, I can only get barricades, and I don't think that would be very helpful, to be quite honest. But at least I got a shotgun. That's something, right? <laughs> right. Okay, a shotgun is going to be a lot more handy than a pistol. Is it actually based on a real shotgun, or is it more like a rifle? I mean, if it was a shotgun, it would spread out its damage at a distance, and it would only be very helpful at close range. Okay, yeah, I kind of see it. Yeah, I saw it blossoming out like that. It also seems to take longer to reload, which I guess is fair. And otherwise, you'd be OP with this thing. There's got to be some kind of downside, right? Other than finite ammo. Okay, crap. How in the hell? I There weren't even any zombies near me. What the hell? That's bull crap. Well, now I have a slightly better grip on things. I think I'll go with the woman this time, because why the hell not? I may as well. I may as well see if they have their own perks or something. Maybe they each have their own abilities. You know, come to think of it, this camera is kind of like Hunter the Reckoning. I don't know if anyone's ever played that for the GameCube and the PS2 and the Xbox. I never really played it. I probably should one of these days. Maybe I'll download it or something because it would be impossible to find in stores. It's two generations old after all. But, yeah, it was similar to this. It was actually, it actually looked pretty cool. And then you ended up having to fight this, this vampire named Warden Deegan Hearted. It actually looked pretty cool. And just to make it more tense, more intense, Warden Deegan Hargood was resistant to bullets, so you had to get up and close and personal with him with melee attacks. Ah, crap. And there was this, there was this black woman that you could play as, that her specialty was basically to heal herself and to heal her teammates. It was actually a good ability. She, she was a well-rounded character. And I didn't realize until after I picked her that you can actually turn around while running away and shoot at them, which actually made that other woman more useful because she was able to run faster. But on the same on the same token, her being able to heal herself and her teammates at a higher level, that was also useful too. So, you know, depends on what kind of strategy you wanted to play as. Obviously, that other woman was more of... A run and gun kind of kind of woman, seeing as how she was the fastest of them. Yeah, there are two different women and there are two different men. I don't remember. But anyway, okay, what should I get? Uh, maybe a mortar? Nah. You know what? I'm gonna get an MP5 because why not? It'll give me a full automatic. Eh, you know, a fully automatic weapon. That's that's really good. Obviously not as helpful as the shotgun, but you know. Hopefully, it'll make up for it by just being faster. Alright. Bring it on, you sons of bitches. There we go. Much easier when you can just shoot rapidly. 
Take that, bitch. But of course, reloading will probably take forever too. Just like the shotgun. Eh, actually it's faster. Of course, the downside, obviously, is that it'll run out of ammo like a bitch. But, oh well. Who cares, right? Okay, here we go. Cool. Very cool. Very nice. Ooh, speed! Yes, please! I want to get that money before it... before it runs out. Also, being able to get away from these jackasses helps, too. Okay, I think I should probably get some towers. Okay, okay, one tower, because that's all I can get. And restock my ammo, because why the hell not? I think I'll put it near the fire. Near the fire, that way it's near the middle. Since I can only get one of them, having it near the middle might serve my purpose more fairly. Oh, cool. I can just reload by pressing R. Well, who knew? Okay, this, this is a cool game. I like it. Even though I kind of screwed up and I stopped the recording, it's... It's my fault, not the games. I can't fault it. Now that I figured out that P is to open up the shop, and you can only open up the shop between rounds, which makes sense, it's... I'm really getting into the, the swing of things. Yeah, it's really a, a lot easier. It's getting a lot easier for me. Okay. Two fully automatics on the battlefield. I think I'll be just fine. Okay, come on, you bitch. Can you repair these, actually? Or can you only refill them for ammo? Yes! Insta-kill! <laughs> oh, this is very helpful for this weapon. Because it means that I am... Well, okay, it's not so much helpful when you can't kill anything because the round ended. M16, I think I'm gonna go with that. And I think I'll just refill you. Yes! <laughs> this is kick-ass! I've got a better fully automatic weapon. Even though I don't have a lot of money now. In fact, I have next to nothing. All I can do is restock ammo, and I don't have enough for that. It's too bad they can't just let you restock whatever you have. It's too bad they can't let you restock ha partially, like they just drain all your coins, and then they only replace however much they cost per bullet. You know, that'd be helpful. But I won't complain. Oh, okay. It's a little slower, but it is a lot more powerful, so... You know, it, it balances out. Crap. And of course, okay, actually the reloading is pretty much the same. Man, these zombies have quite a reach to them, don't they? They can hit you when they're not actually on top of you. I mean, look at that. That's a, that's a bit of bullshit. Whatever. And my turret's dead. That sucks. Or my tower, or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> look at that. That zombie wasn't even near me. That's, that's a load of bullshit. Just a little bit. <laughs> you know, they could have slightly less reach, or at least make it not so misleading. Make it so that just because they look small, maybe there's some kind of poof cloud to, to show you that they can reach you. You know, not make it look like they can only reach a certain ways. I mean, they shouldn't, they shouldn't be able to only reach two inches from you, but then it, they actually hit you from two feet away. That doesn't make any sense, but whatever. You know, it's, it's a, it's a demo of a free game. I, I can't complain too much. I mean, I can complain a little just because I'm me, but, you know, I'm not going to complain too much. Okay, restock. Man, restocking this weapon is pretty expensive. Oh, well, I guess that's the price of war, right? All right, I gotta place it now. Oh, I get four of them. I didn't even notice that. Oh, it's just a, a level four, or whatever it is. Okay. Whatever. Come on. Come on, you bitch. Well, at least they're going straight to the turret first, which means I can pick them off while they're going towards the turret. See, look at that. That zombie should not be able to do that, unless that's a, a long-range zombie or something. What is that, a long-range zombie? That doesn't make any sense. And man, the turret is dying fast. Damn. These are some tough zombies. Some tough mother effers, I tell you that much. Damn. Come on, damn it. Okay, okay. Okay, just gotta... Just gotta pick them off. I got plenty of ammo, I just gotta pick them off. 
and try not to get killed. Well, that's easier said than done in this. Damn, my health is already starting to get low. Just because. These zombies seem to have bullshit range. I can't tell how far away they can hit me. They seem to just magically hit me out of nowhere. Doesn't make any sense. Okay, I'm gonna switch to this. Just because. Damn it. Okay, I may as well get the ammo for the better weapon. Oh, wait, is that the last zombie? If so, I kind of want... Oh, okay, he's not the last zombie. Not even close, not even by a long shot. Okay, speed. Speed is certainly some kind of key. Not sure which. Okay, come on. There we go. That's much more like it. Actually, no, it's not. Kind of sucks. Okay, a rocket tower. Hells to the air! Yeah! I'm gonna use and abuse the crap out of this. But first, you know, standard turret right there. And then the rockets, baby! <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Hells yeah, rocket launcher. That is what I want. That's what Papa wants, if you know what I mean. <laughs> let's see them, let's see those bastards take me on now. Let's see you take take on a rocket launcher. Maybe I should have put the rocket launcher close to the turret. That way it could protect it and me. Well, it can protect zombies from that end. So, it's still helpful, I guess. Crap. Okay, the turret is still alive. Right, I forgot I put it down there. Ah, come on. What kind of bullshit is this? Come on. You should not be able to hit me from that far away. That is a piece of shit. I'm not sure if you guys can see it too. But I see those tow those zombies hitting me from way too far away. Because that's kind of bullshit. Okay, they don't seem to have their own abilities. They seem to just be the same. So, you know, I think I'll just do this round and then I'll call it. Because I think three rounds are plenty. Probably. Obviously, I can't do anything here because, uh, I don't have any money yet. Kind of sucks. They should give you enough money to buy something. Maybe just one tower. That would be helpful, wouldn't it? Okay. Come at you, sons of bitches. Where are you hiding? There you are. Thought you could get away from me, did you? Okay, come on. Damn it. Look at that. See? That's a little bit bullshit. You should either lower the decrease the range of the zombies a bit or, you know, change their attack animation so that it looks like they they should be logically able to hit me from farther away because right now it just looks kind of like it's, they're bullshitting it. Like they're just swinging in front of their face but somehow hitting me, which doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Just saying. It doesn't really make sense with the animation. It's hard to get a good tell for how far I am and if I'm outside of their melee range or not. That's all I'm saying. Nice. Fire rate. I love how I always get all the best perks right as the, the round's about to end, which kind of sucks. Okay. Um, what should I get? Yeah, I'll get a tower. And the shotgun, because why not? Why not get the shotgun again? Okay, it's a level 2. It's kind of weird. Does that mean the more you get, the higher level they are? I can only assume. Perhaps. Hopefully the shotgun will do something. I love the shadow effects, though. Although, of course, that's Unity's doing. I know that the hard way, that that's pretty much Unity's doing. Come on. Okay, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Here we go now. Okay, that was a miss. Well, at least the shotgun is killing them pretty fast. That's what I like. That's not too bad, actually. Ooh, it's to kill. Well, that's not as useful with the shotgun, is it? Well, it is when they're farther away. That way, they spread out more. 
Okay, come on. Come on, you sons of bitches. Yeah, just try it. Okay, cool. Damn, I didn't get that much. I mean, I didn't get that much money. Well, it's enough to get another tower. <laughs> yeah, that's always good. Here, you get a friend now. Oh, don't you like that? Wow. It doesn't cost that much to replenish shotgun ammo, and yet I managed to skirt under the bar on that one. Well, at least reloading was pretty fast. It's always a good idea to reload when there aren't any enemy when there aren't any enemies around, especially. Well, there are some that there there are those minority games where they actually play the whole concept of reloading a little bit more realistically with clip-based weapons, wherein if you reload, but when if you reload with half a clip, you lose the whole clip. You lose the half of the clip that you had. So it's more realistic, but at the same time, it's a bit more of a pain in the ass because it means you can't just... I mean, I'm pretty sure by now, any game that has reloading, people just instinctively reload when there are no enemies around because that way they're fully stocked. But then there are games to where if you have half a clip and you reload, then you lose that half a clip because he basically threw that half a clip away. And you get what I mean. It's realistic, it's just annoying. It's one of those cases where a game being realistic isn't necessarily better for it. I mean, it would be like a game where if you got shot in the heart, you would die, you would bleed out in seconds, because that that's realistic, but that doesn't mean it makes the game better. You know what I mean? And what I'm, what I'm saying is, just because something is realistic doesn't necessarily make it better for the game. That's all I'm saying. Okay, uh, medium barricade, and a small barricade. Okay, I'm gonna try... Okay, here we go. Not too bad. It's a bit of a buffer. Okay. Okay, good. I can I can do it like that. Just gotta come on, reload. There we go. That does make it a little harder for the zombies from that side to hit the turrets. Always good. That's always good, right? Now it feels more like a tower defense game. Because, you know, I have more turrets to work with. And it's not just me by myself. This is probably how I should have done it from the be from the beginning. They're distracted with my turrets, and I can shoot them by myself, and I don't have to worry about losing health so much because they're distracted. They're trying to destroy my turrets and my barricades, and I can just take pot shots at them. I can take cheap shots at them. That's always good, right? Being able to take cheap shots. I love it. I love taking cheap shots. <laughs> I'm cheap. Sh I'm Metroid Cheap Shot Junkie. That's my middle name. Always good to have a speed. Always good to take a speed boost. You know, it's kind of like acid. Okay, uh, get another tower. Get another medium barricade or two. Yeah, we're doing good right now. Now that I'm actually thinking more strategically about this. And, you know, I'm not just winging it by myself. I'm actually doing something here. Okay, come... Oh, crap, okay. Re... Ah, oh, damn it. it. It costs too much money to restock. Oh, well. I've got four turrets, and I've got 54 shells. I think we'll do just fine. Don't you guys think I'll do just fine? You need more faith in me than that. Come on. I can't hear you. Do you have faith in me? Say yes or no. Okay, to all those, to all of you, to all of you who said no, you know what? I don't really care. <laughs> you can do whatever. If you don't have faith in me, then I don't much care. Because I'll do it with or without your faith. I don't need your faith. Although your faith would be nice, I can do. I, I'm fine on my on my own. Who needs your faith? Nah, I'm just kidding. You guys are cool. I'm sure most of you said yes. Most of you actually watch my videos. So basically, five of you. I'm pretty sure four out of five of the five viewers said yes. Maybe. I don't know. Hooray! Insta-kill! Hooray! Okay, there we go. Not too bad. Not too shabby. We're doing good. I've got four turrets right here. All locked and ready to go. Now, where are the zombies? Ah, oh, don't tell me they're afraid now. <laughs> Come on, buddy. What, have I gotten too good now? Am I now too good for my own good? <laughs> Holy crap. 
Where are the zombies? Where'd they go? Obviously, they're not all dead, because the round's still ongoing. What, did they get lost? Come on. Come on, what kind of crap is this? Am I going to have to look for the zombies myself? Or, it's let's be honest, it's probably just one zombie that got lost. There's probably I'll probably find some zombie somewhere clipping on the geometry or something. Or trying to run through a wall or something because the AI and... Even the, even the best of AI games aren't perfect. Because, you know, even Unity's pathfinding isn't perfect. I'm sure there's a, a zombie stuck somewhere. Maybe. I don't know. It's always possible. What the hell? Huh. I don't... Or, or does the game just end after you survive four nights? That would suck. Actually, I'm pretty sure that's not it, because I'm pretty sure the last time I survived more than four nights. Huh. Okay. I mean, if I can't find anything, if the, if the game isn't going to progress from here, I may have to just call it. This may just be the end of the demo, I don't know. You'd think it would be endless, though. That would, that would make more sense. Oh, well, I guess the game dev couldn't think of anything else to throw at me, so, uh... Although it would be nice to have a message proclaiming me the winner or something. Well done, you destroyed the curse. The zombie curse is now destroyed and humanity can live happily ever after. You know, something like that. That would be nice. But, oh well. Now, I'm not seeing any zombies. Are you seeing any zombies? I mean, if there are any I missed, feel free to tell me in the comments below. But otherwise, eh, it's about that time anyway. It's probably, I've probably been playing long enough anyway, let's be face, let's face it. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back to, to the middle and see if there's anything else. But, other than that, okay. Well, I'm back in the middle, I don't see a damn thing. I'm, I'm gonna assume the game stops here. I'm just gonna assume there's no more game after this. Well, thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like hot gas through a forest. Check out the link in the description below as... Almost always, the game that the game is free to try for yourself. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a pleasant day. Thank you so much for watching this Let's Play. If you really enjoyed it, then check out the annotations for some more Let's Plays I've done in the past. Or if you're on a mobile platform, that's what the cards are for.